This is our Team Canada continuous shot warm up. So how this works, X1's just gonna start with a puck. Same thing down on the other side. So it's just a half ice drill. So how it's gonna start, X1's gonna come in, they're gonna take a shot. After they take a shot, they're gonna start heading towards the other line. X3 is gonna give them a pass. They're gonna give it back. So we got a pass coming to X1. They're gonna give it back to X3. At the same time, X2 is looping around the line. After that pass comes back to X3, we're just gonna pop it over there. X1, after they give that puck back to X3, they're gonna come back, time it so they're not going offside with X2. X2 is gonna come in, we're gonna drive this back side. We're gonna take a nice and early shot, looking for a rebound to X1, who's gonna come crash the net. They're gonna stop, and then they're gonna hustle out. After X2 takes that shot, they basically take their same route X1 did to start the drill. So they'll loop back, X4 will start here. We'll say X5 is gonna be looping around, sorry, the other way. They're gonna be coming around this way. We're gonna pass, give it back. We're gonna loop, stay on side. We're gonna spot it over. We're gonna take that nice early shot. We're looking to crash that backside lane. So it's just one whistle to start. After that, it's continuous. Uh, lots of puck movement here where we're making those early passes, getting it back, lots of quick, quick touches, getting our feet moving. And the biggest thing is looking for that shot for a rebound. We're looking for our goalies to control it, uh, but we are looking for that crash on that backside. Uh, so really good drill. Make sure your players stay on side. That's probably one of the biggest things that we harp on them for, um, because it's definitely a game-like situation if we look at it as a quick uh, attack drill and we're looking for that crash, looking for a rebound, stopping at the net, really, really good habits to have.